Holly Willoughby's 2021 venture away from screens and into wellness has continued to face difficulty becoming a success. Although the ITV star's brand, Wild Moon was said to become the British answer to Gwyneth Paltrow's company Goop, its accounts and figures have failed to match up. Three years after setting it up, the business has just £1,885 in reserves, as per Mail Online. Accounts reveal that although the company has assets of £585,633, it owes creditors £583,748, meaning it is only just staying in the black. Wild Moon has often been compared to Marvel Stars Goop as it also sells exotic candles, wax melts, and diffusers. While Holly's brand has not yet measured up to her rival's $250 million net worth, it's a significant improvement from accounts filed in October 2023. At the time, they had more than £283,000 in assets but £310,000 was owed to creditors, meaning Wild Moon had just £149 in assets. The accounts also Holly is referred to in the documents by her married name Mrs. Holly Baldwin took a £46,000 advance in the year up to October 2022. As well as candles and perfumes, the website contains beauty and style advice and a section on spirituality where readers are advised on crystals, healing and auras. Holly has previously said that the idea to launch her own lifestyle brand came to her in 2018 while she was in Australia hosting Emma Celebrity alongside Declan Donnelly. She said, I've always been fascinated with the moon, space, shooting stars and looking up. On holiday, I spend more time on the sun lounger at night than during the day. The moon is always there, like the sun no matter where you are in the world. The presenter added, It lost a part of who I was and that rediscovery has led me here, to a whole new place of beauty and power.